I don't know, noob. I think somebody mentioned, I think a few people mentioned yesterday that they were all the same, but yes, Deox, you both need to be online. To, that is why, like, we are truly grinding with this, uh, with Friend Safari right now, is trying to unlock as many third Pokemon, you know, as we can. So that, um, we can do it before the, the online play goes down. Oh, get on, I, sh I should, I should go bike mode. Very real, very true. Steph! You're gonna install it yourself? Is that is that is that what I'm hearing right now? You're a real one for that if, if this is the case. Oh, you're okay. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, you're a gamer. I would love to to do it myself, but alas. That's so exciting, Steph. Uh, you're sending one of your your 3DSs out? I would love to send... It's not a new 3DS XL, it's just a 3DS XL. But I'd love to send out my Animal Crossing one, but... I'm too scared to do that. Hello, Trick Switch, how are ya? Yeah, 3DSs, and they're probably only gonna get more and more pricey as this time goes on, so... It's scary to, to get in there. And I, I'm too scared to change batteries in my Game Boy games. Game Boy Advance games. What's up, G-Money? How are you, gamer? Good to see ya. Hope you're well. Oh, that's so fun, Steph! I love that! You are s that Oh, that's gonna be beautiful. I'm so excited for you. All right, there's the tomb. They start costing a carpet, right? <laughs> All right, let's see what happens. It's not that hard. Y'all underestimate. Y'all think too highly of me. Let's let's all let's all Remember 10 minutes ago when my mic was backwards? I, I don't I don't trust myself. Hair tweezers, soldering iron, you can do it. Really straightforward. Good times. True stain. This is a great question. Yeah, Water Wolf, I would love to do some dream address stuff. That's the plan on Sunday. On Sunday, what we'll we'll probably do is do a little bit of stun fist hunting and sword and shield and then do some animal crossing new leaf on stream to say 07 nice dark knight congrats on the on the spirit tomb i love that spirit tomb is a friend safari pokemon You can trade if you're not, like, using the internet, you know? Going to tech school to work on circuit boards and industrial equipment, but not messing with those boards. They're scary. They are scary. DA tours. Can you imagine? I think that my my dream address for my my New Horizons uh, island is is somewhere out there. I'm not sure. I think it might be somewhere out there. Also, hello, Jarm. Hope you're well. Yeah, I think Pretendo <laughs> is gonna is gonna do good things. And help help people out.
Zach, yeah, if you if you join the Discord, if you're of age to join the Discord, you can add your stuff to that uh that spreadsheet. Friend Safari. Hello, Yoshi. How are you, gamer? Thank you for the eight months. How are ya? Hello, hello. I hope you're well. What's up, Indigo? My 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 <laughs> My island is so bad, Ali. <laughs> Sandwich, you'll need somebody to, to check your friend Safari for you. I also need Spirit Tomb to shine today. Hoping for a miracle here. Yoshi, how are you, gamer? It's good to see ya. Hello, hello. Hope the day has been uh, treating you well. Laugh Attack, thank you for the tier one for two months. Thank you, gamer. My hair just... Getting in my chapstick. Thank you for the two months. I hope you're well. I am also manifesting the spirit tomb. Um, D curse. thank you for the 24 months, the two years. Thank you, gamer. Hope you're well. It's good to see ya. Hello, hello. Who's the kind soul who does the doc? You can you can uh, add your your stuff to the doc yourself, William. Wild fan feed locked in, baby. <laughs> I am locked in for this spirit tomb right now. I've never been more locked in in my entire life. Rice Gamer How are you? Hello, hello. Hope the Tuesday's treating you well. It's good to see you. Hello, gnome It's good to see you, D Kirsch. I hope you've been keeping well. Hello, hello. Hope the hope 2024 has been treating you all right. I know I won't miss Shepard's shiny, but I'm still nervous I'm gonna miss it. Started growing your hair out this past year, had no clue how often it would get in the way. There is truly one of my least favorite things in the world is when you drive in the car you're in the passenger seat or whatever, and somebody puts the window down, and then your hair is just... I hate that. I have a lot of hair, but man. And yeah, we're looking for a spirit tomb today. Another spirit tomb day, just in a different friend safari, so we could phase with different Pokemon. What's a bod stone? Actually, in Japan? Oh, that's so fun. I hope, I hope it was an enjoyable time. Yeah, when I put the, if the windows are going down, I normally, a hat or I just put my hair up. A ponytail or a bun. It's just exclamation point discord, Chad. Couldn't be Joey. Five scrunchies for all that hair. Shaped head never be able to relay mildly. My parents gave me the, you you would never know because I, I do a blowout on my hair once a week. But I have very, very frizzy, curly hair. My hair is very curly, but I blow it out every week just because I find it easier. I've worn it curly here and there, but 
I prefer to just have have the flat hair. You should do the man bun. Simone, we have we have still not found the stunfisk in uh Pokemon Shield. We're we're still vibing and and grinding for it here and there. Next week we'll be back to do an Emerald Rogue and Stunfisk. Oh my god, yeah, I used to live in Oklahoma. And when I lived there, it was so windy. And my hair just like it was it was so bad. So 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 bad. It was so flat there and just so windy. Chad, I don't know what to tell you because you're the only one who has had this problem. To my knowledge. Yeah, it's very humid. Very, 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 very humid in Georgia, which is where I'm from. And it just, like, most of the time, my hair was either just up in a ponytail of some sort. It got, it, it's so bad. Lucy. Honestly, Allie, I have lived in quite a few states when I really think about it. I think overall, I have lived in... I think six states. It's kind of hop, 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 hopping around. Um, Finguin, thank you for the seven months of tier one gamer. Hello, hello. Hope you are well. Good to see ya. Hair is mostly straight. But it curls up at the ends. My hair does the opposite. It's like really curly at the front, at the top. And then it's like kind of straight at the bottom because of how like damaged it is. <laughs> Barely visited six states. Lived in two. Yeah, I would absolutely count college. I count college when in my count. So I would count it. For travel wreck, sleepy cat. I don't know. The general or sub only might be the best place to ask. Garfield running. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll bring Clef all the way there. Joey. <laughs> I, Joey, I didn't know that. That's so fun. The latest Nintendo post about Pikmin. Migs is here, y'all. Scatter. Hello, Migs. There's a lot of states on the east side. Furthest west you've ever been is Minnesota. Wow. I've really only been like... East Coast, West Coast, never really in the middle besides Oklahoma. Is it normal for Americans to move states even for college? I would say yeah. I would say yes. Oklahoma was only for a year, but other than that, I have, like, not been 
really in the Midwest much at all, like around the Midwest. You don't want my friend code, Wiz. You don't want it. There are much more interesting friend safaris, I promise. Don't you know? Midwest locked your whole life. Illinois and Missouri. But I'm moving to Michigan. State did I enjoy living in the most? Probably Georgia since that's where I'm from, you know? Yeah, they charge people more out-of-state tuition. Oh, colleges in the U.S. usually charge less for people from out-of-state. See, this is the opposite of what I dealt with. I got charged more for being out-of-state. Out-of-state tuition went crazy for me. It's less for people in-state in my experience. College is so expensive, y'all. <laughs> oh, thank you, Zach. I appreciate that, gamer. Thank you. Move from France to Washington. Goodness. What a what a what a jump. Added 98 people on the 3DS so far. It really is Chemical Bomb. Also, hello, Chemical Bomb. Hope you are well. You're from Ohio. Certainly a place to live. <laughs> Allie. <laughs> yeah, Steph. Yeah, I, I am, like, no longer really adding just, like, anybody on the, uh, 3DS because now I'm trying to make sure that I get some, like, good friend safaris. I'm trying to prioritize. Let's go, Migs! Migs, what is in your friend safari again? I feel like I've asked you a million times. Huge savings, Churchy. You have one slot left. The drama. Oh, a water type. Going ham on this step. Let's go. I'm so excited for your capture card. I've never, like, properly visited Texas before. I've only ever, like, been in the Dallas airport. <laughs> So many of my connecting flights are in the Dallas airport for some reason. <laughs> we'll see. Lots of hero time. We found a shiny pumpkaboo yesterday. Yeah, Moosey. A, a lot of the places where I've had, like, connecting flights, they don't really feel like... You know? Like, Illinois, I've only been once. And it was because I had a connecting flight at O'Hare. T 
Texas mentioned. What's up, Cake? Hope you're doing well. It's good to see ya. What's up, Mambi? I know, like, truly a good amount of people in Chicago for some reason and, and would, would genuinely like to, to visit one day. Yeah, I have also heard, like, Texas is no good, but Austin specifically, I've heard good things about. We had to drive through Texas. Want to go to the random middle of nowhere America and see what it's like? Oklahoma would probably be a vibe. <laughs> to just see what it's like and leave. Um, uh, specific parts. You liked Austin? I have heard great things about visiting Austin. Oh, Austin on the decline because of how many people have moved there. Pixel piece. Third largest U.S. city. Yeah, Oddstone, there were quite a few. We, we had tornado sirens that would go off every other week as like a test and they were so loud. Joey, you were really close there. Very, very close. And the wind was like crazy. It's true, Dark Knight. Bad traffic, people drive crazy, quite crowded. Public transportation, that's good to hear. Good public transportation is always a W. Miss Al, my, like, truly my biggest tip for if you're wanting to start a YouTube channel is literally just start. A lot of times people will, like, wait or, you know, put it off because they want everything to be perfect but it's never gonna be perfect and just just go for it and make sure you're doing what you love they i i think that like at my school that i specifically went to they told us like when the tornado you know testing the siren testing would be Actually good public transportation. Billy's no good. We also had tornado drills a lot when I lived in um, Georgia. I know, Jack. DC Subway, super easy and convenient to use. I have, Allie. I have been to New York City like three times, I think, but it's been a long time since I've been. I think the last time I went was five years ago. It's been a while. The last time I was there, I did not have a good time. <laughs> I had like a horrible time. But the other times before that, I enjoyed myself. 
Clay loves New York. It's his favorite city, New York City. He has lived in many places, but he is a big NYC fan. As long as it's an only a warning block, Master. Oh, Joey, are you going? When is GoFest? Y'all, I'm not much of a Pokemon Go player, I'll be honest. I can't get into it. I I just, I don't know. I've, I've tried to play it here and there, but for the most part... I've been out of the country one time, and it was uh, Canada. <laughs> so not too far. What's up, Akala? How are you, gamer? It's good to see ya. Hello, Stickbug. It's just like, I don't know. It's not for me. I I, I play it here and there. And, and like, sometimes I'll get back in my Pokemon Go era. But for the most part, like... I just, I would have to spend money on it, and I don't want to do that. Yeah, it really, like, can be bad depending on where you live, Jenna. Only for short bursts. That's kind of how I am. Oh, come on. Go to the polls, baby. It's for my bag. My bag inventory shock. And my Pokemon box. I don't have enough room for all the gamers. I'm doing well, Akala. Doing Epic. well, gamer. It's good to see ya. Jordan, thank you for the two months of Prime. Thank you for Prime and Gamer. Hope you're well. It's good to see ya. Yeah, I don't, I, I, I don't, I didn't live any, near any gyms when I lived back in Georgia, but maybe I live near some gyms now. I definitely probably do. Shock, I'll keep you updated. I might go for a walk today. Only a couple places you actually feel safe to play at. You have over a thousand Pokemon slots in Go and it's still not enough. Yeah, I feel like that's why a lot of the people I know stopped playing Pokemon Go was just because of all that whole stuff since at least 2018. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Playing Pokemon Go in, in, in college was the vibe. Hi, Fear. How are you? You phased again, Walker? At 2,750, oh my lord. Just kind of fell off lately. Can just not like it. I don't know, I like it, I think, but I just, every time I play it, I find that I, I like don't have any room for the Pokemon I want. And maybe I just need to throw them all into home or something, but I just never have, room in my box and in my bag. Hello, Jed. Hope you're well. <laughs> my boxes are a mess. Who would have thought? Hello, Joe. Hope you're well, gamer. Did I say Monday or Wednesday or something? Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. Moosey, you get it. You get it. Choodle Tuesday today.
You know what is a vibe? No, Mayo, you're all good, gamer. You know what, what's a vibe? Pokemon home organizing streams. V, Agent V, like so long ago, used to do Pokemon home organizing streams and I lived for them. I would lurk so hard in them. I think this was like before I even knew V. They were such a vibe. I really enjoy watching people just organize their boxes. Too far gone. What's up, Chaotic Mind? How are you, gamer? Really go to GoFest for me is just having a sleepover with your friends. Following them around in the event, that's a vibe. <laughs> that is the vibe. A PLA organizing stream. And you know what? I think a few of us could use it. Not just me, okay? Tell yourself every weekend you're organized home and it just doesn't happen, Justin. <laughs> but especially me. Okay, thanks, Jenna. Yeah, the Jirachi. It would take you so long. Definitely need it at some point. Galagon, hello, how are you? You have your living decks organized. Nice, Sarah. <laughs> sort of by neck by dex number yeah let's go i love how let's go does it it's a vibe for sure okay gamers i should have peed like five minutes ago when my ads were playing but whatever i have to pee give me one second brb I'm checking a message. Uh, I fear if I open DaVinci Resolve while I stream, my computer will blow up. Um, okay, whatever. I'll figure this out later. I'm gonna go pee. I'll be right back, gamers. Give me one second. Get your checks in while I'm gone. Let me get mine in. Yeah. A scary guy. Big BRB. Okay, I'll be right back, gamers. Give me one second. What's up, Shotgun Kelly? Hope you're well. Hello, Gel.
Okay, we are so back. I, I, I can't believe my mic was backwards. Like, I'm just... I'm never gonna get over that. It's hard to, hard to come back from that, you know? I'm never gonna live this... It's gonna make it into the video. Let it be known. It will be in the YouTube video. I will add it. I, I do think it's funny. I'll be honest. <laughs> okay. Um, hold on. I need to respond to a message real quick. Grab your screenshot. Okay, um, I am typing. I am mega type mode. Hello, Emmy! How was your stream? What's up, gamers? Hello, hello. Welcome on in. Name is Arlie. We are currently doing some Friend Safari shiny hunting on the 3DS in um, Pokemon X and Y right now before 3DS online play shuts down April 8th. How was your stream? What were you up to? Hello, gamers. Welcome on in. Hello, hello. Pixel Bees, you're, you're gonna get a beautiful feature and shout out. It's gonna be great. But hello, y'all. Sorry, you're coming in at a time. I'm currently trying to type a message real quick. But yeah, we're just chill vibes today. Just truly vibing. Hello, Amelia. Vibing and, and hunting and hoping hoping something shines. We're, we're currently looking for a shiny spear tomb and a ghost type um, friend safari right now. I'm glad to hear stream was good. Very, very glad to hear that. Yeah, there are a lot of gamers, Mayo, online. So now is the time to unlock as many third slots as you can. Good third slots. Now is truly, truly the time. This might be lame, but I kind of like leaving my Pokemon in the games that I catch them in. It depends. Sometimes I will I will transfer them to home, but for the most part, I, I kind of enjoy just like keeping them in the games I catch them in. Phantom does have a pretty good one. I'm a little nervous I'm going to miss Shuppets, but hope for the best see what happens also anybody coming in with the emmy raid mods thank you for the shout out again um if y'all need to raid and run it all or whatever you need to do please i will not be offended go take care of yourselves gamers not even downloaded home <laughs> i don't know i i just i prefer keeping them in the in the in the game that we, we caught them in and then like you know when you boot up the game a year or so later or whatever and, and you look at your boxes and you see it and you just remember the story Catching that Pokemon. It's kind of nice. Enjoy lunch, Emmy. Thank you again, gamer. Thank you, thank you. I'm honor honorary blue name. This song is kind of a vibe. We have not found anything yet, Amelia. We're in a new friend safari today. 
Uh, but a, a, a friend safari that still has spirit to him, which is nice. So we have the opportunity to phase with a phantom or a shepherd today, which is fun. Unless you're ribbon hunting, you usually leave your main teams in the game. I do salty. I, I definitely prefer the DS. I, I just grew up with the DS era. So I really prefer those games. Ribbon Master from Emerald all the way to Scarlet and Violet. I love that. Any Phantom, he could be a little cutie. Prefer DS as well. Your Pokemon Go Shinies end up in home. I should do that. I should transfer some of my Go Shinies to home just to remember them. <gasps> Happy birthday to the pup, Amelia. First Pokemon game where you finish the whole deck, Z King. What do you mean? Like, catch them all or see them all? <laughs> See them all was definitely diamond. Catch them all? Unsure. I don't think I ever like properly caught them all as a kid just because I was not trading with people. But I definitely probably finished like the the decks without trade exclusives as a kid. Probably with Gen 3. Have a strong attachment to Platinum. Only achieved the living decks in Scarlet and Violet. You reset your saves too often, so home and bank have been great. I also reset my saves. I really regret resetting all my saves as a kid. But alas. A little athletic theme for the fans. National Dex in a home was worth grinding for. Walker, what did you just phase with earlier? We have not found Galarian Stunfisk, no. It has not shined for us. Reddit to find trades. Ugh. Platinum, hopefully people in the Discord could be more helpful because Reddit is kind of scary. I know, Stain. We've been we've been going sickle mode on that Galarian Stunfist. Not as sickle mode as we could go though, because I've just been doing so many different things on stream. But I do plan on next week we will do more stud fist hunting. <sighs> Hello, Lakomada. How are you, gamer? It's good to see you. I hope you're well. Oh. Inkata is like out here. He is out here. 
he exists. That's a mod party, Arlie. Oh, speaking of mod party, Arlie. Letters are being sent tomorrow, y'all. Subathon letters. They are being sent tomorrow. I'm getting stamps tomorrow. Honestly, maybe Hello, I can get them out today. We'll see, depending on when I end stream. Um, thank you for the thousand bits, mod party, Arlie. I hope you've been well, gamer. Hello, hello. Thank you. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. Snail mail. I finally got the pictures of the cats. The Polaroid pictures. They're pretty cute. I could show you some of them. There's fear accidentally showing people's addresses on stream. But I hope you're having a lovely Tuesday, gamer. I, at first, for a little bit, I really thought that Galarian Stunfisk yellow galarian stuntfisk was just like not in the game <laughs> or not even that i was doing the hunt wrong but after watching ryan ryan was taken find his galarian stuntfisk he's doing it he, he did the hunt the exact same way as me i believe again i feel hopeful i feel positive I feel good vibes. Seeing it shine for Ryan restored my faith. I was really nervous. I was just doing it wrong. <laughs> Shining for both of us, Pab. We'll see. Endless buffering. Oh, no. You hate to see it. Yeah, we're going to be... We're all going to stand in a circle next week and hold hands. And you know what, Moosey? JP would do that. That sounds like a JP thing to do. TBH. Yeah, I think Stunfisk is so overwhelmed with all this attention and he doesn't want it to end. <laughs> What's up, King B? How are you? Unbothered, moisturized, happy, in my lane, dialed in. <laughs> I can link this playlist. This playlist has kind of been banger after banger. I can't deny it. Two hours of chill video game music. some recognition and honestly the recognition he deserves he deserves it stain i i have a feeling it's gonna come up a lot of these playlists, Dire Dire Docs just, it's there. It's always there. I try to share the playlist we listen to in the chat as much as possible because honestly, for the most part, I just let YouTube autoplay music for me and I don't choose. So when people ask for my playlists, I'm like, I truly just let YouTube do its thing. He'll be useless on the team. <laughs> nah, we're gonna go for the Galarian Stunfisk sweep. If we ever make it to that next gym. We're, we're, we're doing the fifth gym, right? The plan was to be done with the badge quest by the summertime. I will definitely, after Stunfisk is found, I will definitely hunt off stream.
If I don't have Sunfisk by summer, I don't know what we're going to do. <laughs> I fear it. Hello, Dundums. I hope the work lurk has been going all right. Hope work has been treating you well. And also, shout out to Seth. Poppin is up there dreaming of Seth, surely. He has been zonked. Apparently, last night at 3 a.m., Poppin was being very annoying, playing with a jingly toy at 3 a.m. So he's probably just exhausted after that, you know, as he should be. Oh boy, 3 a.m. <laughs> Yeah, I don't want to get Stunfisk off stream. I'm going to grind to get Stunfisk on stream. And then after that, I'll probably do a lot of the hunting off stream. Someone's got to play with the Jingle Ball toy on uh, at 3 a.m. Someone's got to do it. Having a break during his night shift. Coffin and Cleva have been going sicko mode playing at like degen hours. Absorbing the vibes. Vile? This is my tip. That's how you do it. Right, Joey? I, for the longest time, didn't know. But then Clay told me that apparently Poffin would run all over me at night, and I had no idea. I'm such a deep sleeper, and every day I, I thank the Lord for that. You have not in the drought. Nothing, nothing shining for us yet. We're about an hour into hunting today. I am in the drought, Hershey. What's up, Hershey? And Kira, hello gamers. How are ya? Hope y'all are well. And out Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee honestly is kind of fun. I know it's a weird vibe, but I kind of enjoy it. What's up, Coldest Case? How are you, gamer? Let's go, Bruce. I am the big spoon and he is the little spoon. <laughs> Cube dude, thank you for the prime. Thank you for priming, gamer. Oh my god, Bruce. The drama of it all. It's some more hunting today, call this case. Nice tie-dye. Good luck with finishing up Y. How close are you to uh, finishing up the game? Hopefully you are able to finish just in time. And thank you for the Prime. Thank you, gamer, for priming. Last gym badge. Very nice, very nice. I ordered a new mug recently, Bruce. And every time I use it, I am, like, trying to be so careful with it. I'm so scared. <laughs> The forced friendship mechanics, dinos. No, no, okay, not not another new mug, Kira. Hold on. <laughs> a mug I ordered like a week and a half ago. Hello, Mosey. How are you, gamer? Yeah, it's like you want to use it all the time because it's such a good mug, but if you use it all the time... Scary out there. What's up, Muckaduck? Your Eevee friend Safari? Goaded. Hello, gamer. Hope you're well. 
I want to eventually go for the uh, the Eevee. And hello, Mosey. Hope you're well. Coldest case, what are we hunting for today? Oh, Kelly, are you going for the Eevee? Yeah, Magadug, your Eevee is huge. It's huge. Eevee is huge. Joey. <laughs> What happened, Joey? You're on for the spear tomb as well. Very, very nice. Oh, Jell, you got an EV earlier? Joey, I am sorry to hear. Joey, Bruce is going to make you a new ball to pass down in your family. Y'all remember Maisie the mouse? My mom got me like a Maisie the Mouse plate as a kid. And it's just like a shitty little kid's plate, but we had it for the longest time and like six months ago or something. My dad, I think accidentally, I don't know who broke it. Nobody will fess up, but I didn't break it. I would, I would own up to it if I did. Somebody broke it. <laughs> Somebody broke the plate. It's kind of sad. But that was just like a plastic Maisie the Mouse plate. It wasn't like anything special. But it was from my childhood. Sad to do it after 25 years of safety. Go for the Ditto Deox. That's a good one. Hell yeah, coldest case. Mom broke it. Party's mom. Any words? Any any thoughts? Shattered your classic Pikachu McDonald's glass. It could have been clever, Poppin, honestly. <laughs> Kelly. <laughs> That is hilarious to me, but also I hope your foot is, was okay. <laughs> it was, if it were anybody, it would be popping, honestly. All right, ads are starting, gamers. Enjoy your advertisement. Oh, you broke the Teletubbies plate? Oh, wait, am I thinking of the wrong plate? Is the Maisie the Mouse plate still okay? Or is that one just, like, gone? Broke a while ago? Okay, is the Maisie plate the one where we don't know who broke it? I promise it wasn't me. I would own up to that. Mom, Bruce broke it. <laughs> Maisie the Mouse is a cartoon mouse moosey that is absolutely iconic. I don't even remember what happened in the show. It was a show, right? It's just a mouse that I love. Duck, I believe it it goes offline. Is it like 7 p.m. Eastern on April 8th? What's up, Sarkane? How are you, gamer? The 8th of April, but I'm not sure what time. Just depends on your, your zone. Just to be set, just to be safe, chemical bomb. There was an alligator in Maisie the Mouse. 
We are vibing, Sarkane, getting as much friend safariing done as humanly possible. And hoping to also unlock as many third slots as possible. And thank you for the five! That's very kind. Thank you, Sarkane. Thank you for the five gifted. If you got gifted us up, I hope you enjoy your emotes. Thank you, gamer. Thank you, thank you. To the song that's playing right now, Bruce. <laughs> the Kirby, I'm assuming it was. Green Greens. Kirby's return to Dreamland. Charlie the Alligator. What's my favorite Pokemon? It is uh, Mudkip. My mom has just sent me the character list for Maisie the Mouse. I don't remember any of them. I only remember Maisie. I'm sorry. Thank you, Sarkane. Thank you, Gamer. Thank you. I am not, Bruce. It's honestly quite peak. Peak music. Seven PM Eastern? Okay. There you have it. I heard somebody say seven PM Eastern yesterday. I can't remember where. I maybe it was Math Stream. I can't remember. We have still not found the stunfisk, believe it or not. That fang is not shot. We're we're getting close to seven thousand. I think we're at six thousand five hundred right now. For stunfisk, but yeah. Still doesn't shine for us, but that's okay. It's alright. I'm feeling fine. I don't mind. I don't mind. We'll get it eventually. What's up, Coop? How are you, gamer? Hello, hello. I know. I'm just, I'm so sad overall for 3DS Online. 3DS Online, I've said it a million times, but it's really like, I, I did, I just did so much online play with, with the 3DS as a kid. I did so much Animal Crossing. I, I'm just gonna be very sad <laughs> when it's when it's gone. I hope you're doing well, Coop. It's good to see ya. Hello, hello. I believe there are, there there is a a thing being worked on. Hoping for the best. What's up, Tuna? Yeah, Friend Safari will still work after the 3DS shutdown. You just won't be able to, like, get people's third slots anymore, you know? Tuna, I gotta be honest with you. You're, you're giving bad vibes. I just gotta keep it real with you. So this week is the week to, like, un unlock as many of those like third slot Pokemon as you can being online with somebody at the same time. But you'll still be able to like use the friend safari after that. To my knowledge. <laughs> Flock master. Never a good start, Bruce. Jenna, all good gamer. We'll see you later. Have a great rest of your day. 
came across me via Fiverr? I don't remember if these are the settings or not. It has been a while since I did that. I can't remember. I have no idea. Which preschool channel did you watch the most? I have no idea what I was watching. All I remember is I liked the Teletubbies and I liked Oswald. Those are like the only two shows I liked. And then as a as a young adult, I got into the backyard again, which I know is not. I got into it, you know, it. I don't think the backyard against was a thing when I was a kid. Poe was your favorite Teletubby. That was my sister's favorite. Mine was La La. I liked the yellow one. When did the backyard again start airing? Oh, a little Earthbound vibe. I don't. I did not watch the Backyard Again until I was older. There's no way Backyard Against was 2002, 2004. It's crazy. Yeah, I was not watching. It was the Backyard Against on like Nickelodeon Kids. You named your dog Lala when you were four after the Teletubbies? Okay, y'all want to hear something crazy? Not to out, out my mom. Mom, I'm going to tell the story about the Lala, the Lala plush. Okay, so as a kid, I had this Lala plush that I loved so much. And it had a tag on the back of it. And I used to love to like run my fingers through the tag just because it felt nice. I don't know. And I ran my finger fingers through the tag so much that the tag basically became like a string. But I loved that Teletubby plush so much. It was just like a stuffed Lala that I had. One day. I don't remember what, what the specifics, but my mom, I think, started to hate that plush because it was so gross because it was just old. I had it for so long and I didn't want to get a new one because I liked the plush as it was. But my mom wanted to buy me a new one because the tag was like practically gone. She thought I wouldn't notice if she just bought a new one. That's not true. One day I saw, I found my mom bought me a new Lala plush and was gonna try to replace it. I don't think I let you replace it. You had a bath and got a new tag is what my mom was gonna say. That's messed up. That's messed up. <laughs> That's mess. This was three years ago. <laughs> no. I was like in first grade kindergarten or something. I don't know. Cold blooded. Had a bath. Until I found the old one. So you kept the old one? So I believed you? You lied? <laughs> What happened when I found the old one? What did I say? I gotta know. I don't re I obviously don't remember any of this, but I do remember some of it. <laughs> Kelly. Hello, Delia. How are you, gamer? How did this make you feel? I was mad. That's hilarious. You still have your first plushie when you were 15, actually. You still not taking care of your plushies. I don't think I was bad at taking. You had to give the old one back to me. Let's go. I got it back. <laughs> Do 
took that thing everywhere you went. This is a story for 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 real. This is a story of all time. Um, what's up, Alola? How are you, Cube Dude? Basically, there's a third rare Pokemon that can be found in your friend safari. In friend safaris, um, but you can only unlock it if you are in that person's friend safari and they are also online at the same time as you. And so this week we are just trying to shiny hunt and unlock as many third slots as possible. She is scratching. Hello, Weppa. Alright, just like that, she's gone. Have the cats used the cactus yet? See, I moved the cactus in the middle of, uh, in the room recently, and they still ignored it. So maybe they just don't like the vibes. One of my favorite things to do is wake up in the morning and all of my stuff on my desk is just on the floor because Cleffa clearly knocked everything down. Very fun and cool. What's up, Scrap? How are you, gamer? It's good to see you. Online at the same time to unlock the third Pokemon. Yes. As long as y'all are both gaming at the same time, that, that third slot. No, I'm blaming... I'm blaming the... I'm blaming the cactus. The cactus, I guess, just has bad vibes. Bantump is your friend. Scrap, what are you crying about? Phoenix, there is no update on the mall. I apologize. We do have some freaky little fellas in this friend safari. That is for sure. Certified silly guys here. I love this song. This is a banger. I did feed the lax breakfast. I started stream earlier today. And nobody applauded me. I have not fed him lunch though. I can do that. Thank you, thank you. I woke up this morning and was like, I'm gonna start stream at 10.30. And I did. My Pokemon box is full. Great. Midnight links, yeah, it is. It is end game. It sure is. All right, it's lunchtime, y'all. It's really weird to be already in in master territory so early in the week for me.
All right. Water Wolf, thank you for the lurk. Moosey, enjoy the reading. Enjoy this fancy apple salad. Subcurrent is kind of like Phantom if you squint. Rumor has it I'll be live every day this week. It is true. I will be live tomorrow. Normally I am not, but I will be. And Friday. It'll be a fun week, that is for sure. And then I'll probably take it easy next week. Hello, Ladybug. Hello, Guac. Enjoy, Celeste. Amelia, enjoy, enjoy. A game I would love to play one day, but I know I will be bad at it. I listen to Celeste music all the time. I really enjoy it. Scrap that is not true. All right, lunch has been served. Back to it. You ordered 48 cream eggs off of Amazon and you forgot about it, Kelly. You want to know an exciting purchase I bought yesterday? A file organizer. I'm excited about it. I know it's like, like a silly little purchase, but honestly, I think it's going to be huge. It's going to help us organize our, our drawers a little bit better. It's going to be huge. Very exciting moment over here. <laughs> also, for anybody who was on the edge of their seat wondering about this, but too shy to ask, the stuffed peppers yesterday were pretty good. Delia, my favorite villager is Biscuit. I really enjoy the dog villagers. Biscuit is definitely my, uh, oh, scrap, there you go. Can rest easy tonight. I made stuffed peppers, but I made them in a slow cooker. Cookie is pretty great. The the dog villagers are truly some of the best in, in, in Animal Crossing. Got bones on your island. Goldie, your goat. I also like I've taught I've told this story on stream before. My first ever Valentine ever was Mac the dog in Animal Crossing City Full. I got a Valentine's Day letter from him. I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh, heck. <laughs> and he sent me some chocolate and I was like, so now I could say my first ever Valentine was Mac. Now when I see Mac, I just, I remember that letter he sent me. Emilio, hello. It was honestly a precious moment. Spork. Kid from New Leaf. Is that the, the cat? Is that the cat who... Looks like a superhero, or am I mixing it up? There's that Kit Kat. Kid Cat is the superhero. Okay. 
Rai, what is your friend safari? What do you have in your friend safari? Do you know? I'm running out of room. So if you are if you are looking for Stunfisk. You have kid in your new leaf town. Oh mamma mia. Where are my phantom believers at? My best friend! <laughs> 21%? Okay, what is this 54% on nothing? What the hell is this? What's going on in this prediction? 11% on Shuppet, 21% on Phantom, 13 on Spirit Tomb, and 54% on nothing. Good lord. Good lord, good lord. Hello, Reese. Saucy, you're getting some saucy points. And it's a woman. Um, can y'all send me, like, the capture? Oh, power? Does that work here? If I'm in the battle already? The shiny is pretty incredible. This is this is pretty great. A woman. All right, let me pay out this prediction for the believers. Thank you, Josh, for the capture power level one. <laughs> Thank you, gamers. I appreciate it. Okay. Also, if you ever find a shiny and you need a capture O power, feel free to share in the chat so that we can we can send that your way. You'd be cut out of the video, Migs. Let's throw a ball. I would love to throw a luxury ball, but I'm thinking, honestly, I would love to catch this in just a, a Pokeball. With the red? I think that could look good, but I don't know. We'll see. Hello, Hayes. How are you, gamer? It's good to see ya. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Got paralyzed. This is huge. I was hoping for that with Whimsicott out. Love him. Okay. Little oh, crit. Thank you, gamers. We're in. All right, anybody got a good name suggestion here? First friend safari shiny of the day? A phantom. We have a good amount of ultra balls. We don't have a good amount of pokeballs though. <laughs> Wiggy. Hello, snowman. What's up, gamer? I like Autumn. I think Autumn or Willow is pretty good. Hello, snack pack. Hope you're well, gamer. I'm good with Willow. I like that. We weren't really talking about anything crazy, so... Let's go check it out. Voila. <laughs> yeah, get your get your nature guesses in here. I'll guess quiet. At the two hour mark, Pat, you said that? How about that? I'm gonna guess quiet. And it is docile. Did anybody say docile? Tom!
Let's go! Ladybug as well? I have no idea if you guessed it before I showed it. <laughs> but, but what are you- I hate- I hate it sometimes when your cats start just like staring off into the distance. And they're like- and it, It's just like there's nothing there. What is there? Let's go, Ladybug. <laughs> Alright, two friend safari shiny Pokemon of the week so far. Should we keep going for Spear Tomb, y'all? Or do we want to check out a different friend safari? What are we thinking? Oh wait, let me save. Stay for the, for the tomb? Really? Thank you all for the capture power. I could go go check out the fan feed. <laughs> yeah, scrap. Thanks. Okay, I, a gamer that I was kind of interested in looking for is Tunkus's Pincer. Tunkus has a bug friend safari with Pincer in it. How do y'all feel about a little Pincer moment? I know we caught like 15 last week, but... I think this is Tungus, right? I thought we already checked the friend safari though. With the pincer. Oh, more than one person has a pincer, okay. Is Roxas online right now? Hello, pretzel. I need to get that Absol. Oh, I do? It's unlocked? Okay, never mind. NVM. Oh, Crawdon as well. That's fun. Alrighty. Well, we could continue for Spirit Tomb here. Go for Pincer. I feel like Pincer could be fun. I say I say let's go go Pincer mode for a little bit. I don't know what else is in there. Safari, but we'll we'll, we'll see. Who knows? Oh scrap. Rock says you are online, okay. You have an Absol, which is huge. So cool. Purple Nurple the Pincer. Imagine this pincer is blue. Can you imagine? Alright, let's see what, what the other gamers are in here. Ball beat. <laughs> This is not what I like to see. Bullbeat, pincer. Whoa, Migs! Phantom just shined for us, yeah. Oh, Volpi is... That is, a, that is a choice. Maybe Butterfree is the other one? Or Dust? I don't know. I don't know. Volpi's face is just a little alarming. Volpi is jumping. Yes, thank you, Walker. I'm, I'm pleased with the Phantom, but I, I will probably go for Spear Tomb offline. But I want to try to keep it a little fun and fresh on stream and, and go for other things as well. 
I think it's the face on Volbeat that is that is kind of scary. Volbeat's hoodie is too big. <laughs> I think it's just right. I loved an oversized sweater moment. Okay, what the heck is the other Pokemon, dude? It does look like a Nick fellow. Oh, Combi! Interesting. Okay. All right, gamers. I'll give you 10 minutes. Imagine it's female. Shiny male combi. Let me look at the other pincer real quick before we commit. Random Doodle has Beautifly, Paris, and Heracross. Paris, Volby, and Pinsir in Vix Bug Type 1. Vivian and Mido. Dude Man has a Bug Type. This is a Heracross Type. Paris and. Illumis is and Pinsir and then Butterfree Volbeat Pinsir Beautifly Butterfree and Georgie's Now Georgie Now Georgie Oh, Hayes, I'm so sorry to hear that, gamer. I am sending all the good vibes to you and your family. I am very sorry to hear that. That is never, never easy. Georgie, I'm on my way. Pinsir, Beautifly, Butterfree. Good luck, gamers. Beautifly is great. I am a big, big fan. Read the spreadsheet is in the Discord. It's a 16 and up Discord server. There's a bit of a barrier for the Discord just so that the spreadsheet isn't accessible to, like, anybody. Look at that. Little beautiful moment. Guys, we just caught a phantom. We were looking for Spiritomb. We've looked for Spiritomb in two Friend Safaris and not gotten it, but that's okay. That's all right. A little Butterfree mo- I would be very pleased with- with Butterfree. Will we ever find what we're looking for? This is the question. Yeah, honestly, I was pretty happy to not get Shuppet. I didn't really care for Shuppet that much. Happy to find something today. I, I, my, my overall goal, I was talking- to a friend about this this morning. My overall goal is to find at least one thing a day. One Pokemon a day is the goal. Uh, get your points in, gamers, if you'd like to predict. Get them in, get them in.
One Pokemon a day keeps the doctor away. Migs, I will not be doing that. Nothing since the... You got Shiny Azumarill? Whose friend Safari was that, Tunkus? Is that Pixel Bees? I could be making it up. There could be more than one Azumarill. I just, I have no idea. Pigs. <laughs> Their ticket's pretty great. It was my, okay. Saucy, congrats on your points for the Phantom. How close up the encounters are in X and Y. They are pretty close. They do be right up in the face. Lots of beautifly. Also, Cliff is sitting here with us today. She's just been sitting there for like 10 minutes, staring at me. She's asleep. I cannot imagine sleeping sitting up like that. What's up, Kirsby? We have found a singular phantom today. I'm gonna wake her up. Going baby mode. He's on an oh no, <laughs> another phase, Starcelin. Are you painting? I was doing a little bit of painting. That is Clay's painting right there, and then the completely unfinished one is right there, and that is mine. Doing some a little bit of painting the other day. Imagine you just turned around and faced the camera. How huge would that be? I did not! Was there an April Fool's video for streamers with cats? I am interested. She's feeling a little shy. What's Poppin' doing up there? Oh. He is getting in that foot. That leg is high. He is cl he's cleaning his toes right now. Anyway, give him the privacy deserves a poppin moment indeed i want to get them a cat like bed thing for the windows i feel like they would really enjoy that
Puppet is the main character. She really is. Wow, a little shelf for your window for your cat to hang on. I love that. Okay, they both left. I don't know why, though. Now it's just us. Coffin's back. Oh, there he goes! There he goes! He's loafed up. I'm so happy that you get to see so much more Poffin on stream now. The hell is this song? actually have pretty different personalities. Cleffa is like pretty chill. She's like a rock. And is very, very cuddly. Poffin is very anxious and weird and Cleffa is like very chill and cuddly. Poffin doesn't really like to be touched. Like if you're gonna pet Poffin, he's gonna squirm around. He wants to be pet though. I don't know. He just can't sit still. Coffin is a lot more shy than Cleffa as well. Cleffa is definitely more outgoing and just very cuddly. She's a very affectionate cat. Coffin not so much. Coffin is definitely more playful. Every time we try to play with the cats, Cleffa will just like lay down, <laughs> but Poffin will run around. Coffin is definitely more like a cat, and Clef is more like a dog. Ooh, okay, noted, Rai. Noted, noted. I can add you after stream. Little bit, hello? Hope you're well. Cat is more similar to Poffin. I feel like most cats are like Poffin. Frantic and kind of just all over the place, you know? He's just, he's a weird little guy. And every time I talk about how Poffin is a weird guy, I don't think anybody really believes me. But Clay can vouch that Poffin is weird. Clay also, I don't think, believed me. But he can definitely vouch. Poffin is weird. Yeah, Poffin will have a very, very, very rare affectionate moment. He has to be, like, sleepy for it to happen. Poffin is a tuxedo cat. He sure is. He's a certified weirdo. You take the moon. Poffin is not weird. He's Migs. unique. Hashtag stop the Poffin slander. If you... Also go beautiful, please shine. <laughs> if you spent 10 minutes with him, you would understand. He's just staring at us all. He's loafed up, just staring. Oh. He's probably thinking about nothing. He's locked in.
<laughs> hey, little Puff. What you thinking about, bud? Take the Moon is from Chowder. Thank you, Mix, for the hundred. <laughs> Take everything that seems like fun. Stir it all up and then you're done. Rada, 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 rada. Okay, Pavin, you just, you sit right there and you do that. Yeah, the Pokemon Adventures Collection Edition. I got those bad boys. They're very lovely. <laughs> Only the works of George Orwell. <laughs> yeah, Poppin wants a little, a little bacon grease. Pinsir is pretty pale. Very pale man, that is for sure. Tungus, oh seven to you. You did your time. You did. You did the good work. Let it be known. Ditto hates you. How long have you been at it for Ditto, Kelly? Have you found anything else? Whoa, wait, wait, wait. were you not going for Eevee? Or is Ditto and Eevee in the same? Are they in the same fence, Safari? Sometimes just switching safaris to change the vibe a little bit, it's 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 the way to do it. I have not read much of it at all, Dark Knight. My dad uh very would frequent this comic book store. And he would go there so often for like Star Wars stuff that the owner and him became pretty good friends. And the owner started getting the collector's editions for the Pokemon Adventures. Um, and I think my dad bought them from him to help support the business. And he would send them to me whenever I was in college as like a fun little gift here and there. Very kind of my dad. Ah, oh, your save is still there, Midnight. Let's go. He's on a palm yesterday with Ditto. I see, I see. I would like to read them, though. 2,800, let's go. Dragonair not been kind to you. Well, the good news is... As we all hunt for this... We are unlocking those those third slots and whatnot, all playing online together, which is nice. So you can always go back.
This song is a vibe, I'll be honest. I'm like silent because I'm just vibing Our to him. Bond. What's up, Alonso? What's up, Dealandry? Thank you for the five months of Prime, gamer. Thank you, thank you. Hope you are well. Thank you for priming. Shout out to the Primers of America. Alonso, how are you? Happy Tuesday, gamer. Yeah, I don't think I've been to Kelly's Safari yet. I think Kelly might have the only fairy type in my game. Like, I've not added anybody else who is fairy type. I am well, Alonso. I woke up early this morning, which is huge for me. Slept well. Woke up to a regular Raikou in sleep. Not shiny. Been a good day so far. Making some pancakes. You love to see it. I am really, really looking forward to dinner tonight because Clay is making this like really, really lovely like buttered tofu dish. And in the past when he's made it, we have not had the tofu press, but we've been, we, I pressed the tofu overnight. I cannot wait to see how different it is. Honestly, demon, you're right. <laughs> I was trying to do some wonder trading yesterday and just like a little bit of last week doing some wonder training with Absol Blogs' streams and my 3DS like died immediately <laughs> and it was charged and everything before I before I started trading it was tough it was tough what's up Matt how are you gamer the 3DS died like literally immediately You're on life support. Have a replacement battery. Just waiting as long as possible before you replace it. I would say all of mine need to be replaced. And still buy them from Nintendo? That's good to hear. You puffin. Got three badges yesterday. Have today off and have megas now. Yeah, I think you'll be able to cruise through it for sure. Could do the mega Lucario sweep. Let's go, Star Saloon! <laughs> Was this in my friend Safari? My all-time favorite Pokemon game is Emerald. Uh-oh, Starry wishing. The, the batteries, 3DS batteries. Let's go. Congrats on the squirrel. Hello, Leafeon. A Meryl Squishmallow. Ay ay ay. Emerald versus Oras. I have made my opinions on Oras. Maybe a little too loud and clear, but I'm not the biggest fan of Oras. I didn't really enjoy them as remakes. I'm a known Oras hater. I just didn't like the changes they made in Oras. P 
best remake? See, my favorite remake is Forever Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Hello, Hiplop. How are ya? Gamer, it is good to see ya. Infamous Emerald Enjoyer. Yeah, Fire Red and Leaf Green are definitely remakes. They make Kanto bearable, in my opinion. I'm happy to hear that, though, Kaizen. I love that. They were so good, Zane Ludicolo. Ooh, at the end of a five-day weekend. That's how I feel about X and Y when it comes to like the Team Flare fights. Just having to battle so many of the same Pokemon at the end of the game. All right, gamers, ads are about to start. Enjoy your advertisement while it plays. I'm going to go pee. I will be right back. Before the physical special. When you had to replace your 3DS battery, you'd keep checking Nintendo regularly because they sell out fast whenever they're restocked. Okay, so they sell out fast. Noted. Very well noted. The level curve. <laughs> Good times, good times. Okay, I'll be right back, y'all. Really quickly. We are being among us. Ah, uh, yeah, give me one second. Hello, Gwendolyn.
Okay, speaking of... Clay's 3DS capture card is a galaxy. It's so nice. Playing on this, this is Clay's capture card. It's so nice. It is, it is so, so, so nice. It's his, this is his new 3DS XL. It like, just like the buttons feel so lovely. And the like circle pad isn't like busted like mine is. It's very enjoyable playing on his 3DS, I will be honest. I don't know, Clay. <laughs> Oh, really, Steph? I love that. We were just, people were talking about the Galaxy one, Clay, and so I had to show yours off. Bust it. It's our 3DS. Oh, my circle pad is fine. It is pretty bad. All right, Cleffa. How long are we sitting like this? Hello, Bork. How are you, gamer? Now she'll never go down. I think the 3DS XL that has Xerneon, Xerneas on it launched with X and Y. Yeah. That one goes crazy. Me too, Kaizen. I'm so happy. It is nice to have the, uh, the cats here. No Gen 3 cartridges on the on the 3DS, no. You'll I I I am because I think that, you know, DS games are and 3DS game DS games. GBA games as well. They have gotten so pricey. You gotta do what you gotta do, you know, to 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 enjoy the franchise. Yeah, original the DS you can GBA game. Yeah, that was when he's picked up. <laughs> I need to get them some window window beds, but for now she'll just she'll just sit on my lap for now. $110 on Leaf Green Vicious. Ooh, Super Shiny Panda, that's sicko mode. My sister has the X and Y 3DS. Has a Pokemon tax on it. Wow. Diamond and Pearl seem to have come down after BDSP was released. Really? $110 on Leaf Green, $140 for Fire Red. The copy of Sapphire that I bought recently with set with Steph showing me the link. I, I believe it was $80. In the draw, I truly feel like the best bet you can get is eBay or Facebook Marketplace. You just gotta be careful. Yep, Steph. And then I opened up the link and there were like three other people looking at it. SMH. Really vicious recently? If I buy another Gen 3 cartridge, which I would like to, I would like to buy a copy of Ruby 
I would get it not in English. Just so I'm not, you know, dropping, dropping triple digits. Yeah, that's a good one too, Buckeye. That is where I got my copy of yellow. And my Game Boy Color for a really, really good, good price. <gasps> Found them a few weeks ago. That's so exciting, Hash Browns. Yeah, Coliseum is, is pricey these days. I've also mentioned this recently, but Pikmin 2, so expensive. Like original GameCube, Pikmin 2. Quality on the carts is great. These GameCube games be be pricey. On a modded Wii. GameCube games, Pokemon games, they do be hurt and right, Cleffa. Japanese Ruby, Japanese Colosseum, bonus disc has Celebi. Maddie, I would like Pinsir in this friend safari. We're in a bug friend safari right now, and I'm 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 hoping for Pinsir. what shines for us all starting to rot and he takes care of them oh no clay has a pretty nice gamecube i was never a gamecube girly i never had one my neighbor had a gamecube but and i would play on her gamecube but other than that like growing up my my parents my dad never had one i think he has one now though <laughs> I was much more of a handheld console girly as a kid. I think Shuppet is just shiny locked. <laughs> Oh no, Dijon. Animal Crossing for the GameCube. Ooh, nice. I can't remember how much I paid for my GameCube Animal Crossing, but it wasn't a lot. I also paid like $10 for my Harvest Moon Animal Parade disc. That's on the Wii, but just reminds me. Double Dash. I played Double Dash back in the day. Your neighbor had an N64 back in the days. You're playing games with your neighbors growing up was such a vibe, such good memories. I have so many good memories of, of, of playing in the underground in, in Diamond and Pearl. My friends, so many good, good memories. I think we're going to make a video on it. There's barely even an animal parade. Okay, Jack, you got me there. You're right. <laughs> but still, that game is so good. I love it so much. Dovo, it shuts down on the 8th at 7 p.m. Eastern, I believe. 8th of April.
the Fire Emblem games. Oh, she is. <laughs> yeah, bank is. Uh, for now, I don't believe it, that we've heard anything about bank and whatnot, like. Anything official. What's a base myth? How are you, gamer? That goes crazy. My sister enjoys them. Picto chat went crazy. Filling in the entire thing with with the marker and then writing with the eraser. did encourage you. That makes sense. That makes sense. Dude, flip notes went crazy. I love flip notes so much. Specifically, I was I was thinking about flip note the other day. Color <laughs> the whole message speed run. Um I was thinking specifically about the creator Gizmo on Flip Notes. He was like my favorite creator. I hope he's doing well. <laughs> I was obsessed with the stuff he made as a kid. If you if you explore on YouTube, you can find like those popular Flip Notes that went crazy viral and watch like compilations of them. It's a good time. A very good time. Whoa, banger. What are we listening to? Two hours of chill video game music. Still the same one. Hat and time music. This is like the same song, but it's the remix. We'll do this one. Piano time. Don't have any of the GBA games. I'm so grateful that I did not. I, I don't know what me and my mom were thinking when I was a kid, but I'm just so happy we didn't get rid of them. What's up, Absol? Hello, hello, gamer. Something I am so sad about is I don't know where my DSi went. I had an incredible blue DSi, and I don't remember selling it or like getting rid of it. I know I have my white DS somewhere, my DS Lite somewhere, but my DSi, I have no idea what happened to it. <laughs> I hope you're doing well, gamer. It's good to see ya. I, I like loved the DSi so, so, so much. But I have no idea where mine is. No dire dire docs soon. What's up, Jack? How are you, gamer? Pork, what are you talking about? <laughs> I feel like the DSI, I feel like like a lot of my friends growing up didn't have one.
I was like the only kid with a DSi because you know the DS the DS era was such a like a I don't know I feel like it was a thing for your parents to be like they're all the same you know because there were just the DS the DS light the DSi <laughs> the 3DS you threw your DSi in the bin by accident. Well, you accidentally threw away your DSi? I have no idea where my, like, original DS was. I remember getting it for Christmas. I remember that was a very iconic Christmas, getting my DS with Nintendogs. But I remember playing on my DS Lite more than my DS. Chillin', prepping more wonder trades. Let's go. Hello, Star Volley. How are you? It's good to see you, gamer. DS Lite was the big thing for your area. White DS Lite. I also had the white DS Lite. I named my white DS Lite Barbara after Barbara the Sheep in Animal Crossing Wild World. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. But I always referred to my DS Lite as my Barbara. Barbara the DS Lite. And then it, it snapped in half. It didn't like completely break off, but the top definitely came off for sure. Accidentally threw away your OG 3DS. Knocked it off of your bedside cabinet into your bin and didn't realize. Oh my god. I would also be too scared. <laughs> Skipped the light, went to the 3DS. I bought my 3DS the day Animal Crossing New Leaf came out in 2012. I bought... My mom bought it for me. I had no money. Someone stole your red 3DS? No, dude. That is tragic. I'm trying to think. I don't think I ever had any games or anything get stolen from me as a kid. To my knowledge. Had your favorite SpongeBob game in it. You washed your sister's <laughs> iPad. I am always scared I'm gonna wash my Go Plus Plus because I just keep it in my bed all the time. And every time I do my laundry, I always like check frantically to make sure it's not in the in the sheets. I've washed my AirPods a, an alarming amount of times. I am scarred for life. To really saw soft carpet and one of the hinges snapped. What the hell? <laughs> that is crazy, Pixel Bees. What's up, Nathan? How are ya? It's good to see you, gamer. Oh, Matt. Oh my God. Something I didn't know, Matt, for the longest time because I'm an idiot, was that your Go Plus Plus needed to be, like, set down on a surface. And so a lot of times, I would, like, be holding it up in the air, like, getting ready for bed, and I would press on the button, and it, like, wouldn't work. And I thought that just meant it wasn't charged, and I was like, man, maybe my battery is just bad. And so I would charge it all the time. Not knowing that. It just wasn't working because it wasn't set down, like, on my bed <laughs> properly. <laughs> I am an idiot. <laughs> but yes, I also do that is I will. It will not be charged and I'm like, brother, I am not using my phone. I will stay up and charge it rather than use my phone. 
Chad, we found a phantom earlier, so we switched friend safaris, and now we're we're hunting in a bug one. Friend safari has been pretty good so far today, Nathan. It has been a vibe. Thus far. And we got Cleffa on the lap. Cleffa is here. Truly, no complaints thus far. Hello, Gary. No spirit tomb. We, we found Phantom, and then yesterday we found uh, Pumpkaboo. Spirit tomb was just not shining for us, but that's okay. I'll probably look for spirit tomb today off stream. Do a little, little offline friend safariing. Off stream friend safariing. Your red cartridge went through the washing machine and it worked perfectly after. I love that. My one of my AirPods still works completely fine. It's the right one that never works. And I've washed my AirPods three times. A hundred percent slumbering. Oh, trying to get your action replay up again. We talked a lot about the action replay last week on stream. I wish I, I wish I knew where mine was. I never used it for Pokemon though. I only used it for Animal Crossing to, to run around fast and pay off my home loan. It's been an hour, Pat. We're slacking, y'all. I can't believe two people found Spear Tomb like in the first hour of stream yesterday. That was pretty crazy. You use your action replay for diamond and platinum. I don't I think I was just too scared to use it on my Pokemon games. So I just never did. I think my sister used it though. You brought Ruby to school to show it off and you lost it. Did once the snow melted, did you find it again? <laughs> What's up, Hunter? Hello, hello. We found a we found a phantom earlier. Yeah, when Drum gets here, Migs, Spear Tomb will shine for us for sure. Bounced across a busy but silent room. Ugh. That's no good, Kelly. No good. <laughs> The DS stories are pretty incredible. I'm trying to think of if I have any iconic stories from like when I lost games as a kid. I can't remember. And has a copy of Pearl. Can no longer use the medicine in the bag because of action replay use. Oh my god. <laughs> he has unlimited Master Balls, so it was worth it. Did it still work? After the snow melted? Cleffa, where are we going? Where to? The flute to platinum. Understandable. Understandable. Home wouldn't let you transfer Arceus from bank. Yeah, Kelly, I had that problem too. I, I, I have all of my game cases except for... Pokemon Diamond, which is really unfortunate. I still have my Platinum case, but I lost my Pokemon Diamond case somehow. I don't know where it went, but she is lost. And I think that is due to just not putting my games in the correct cases and whatnot as a kid. We've caught one today so far, Mambi. We've been on a one a day streak so far, which I'm I'm pleased with. I'll take five.
What's up, Stigo? How are you, gamer? Hope you're well. Robert, we're looking for pincers specifically here. But I'll take a phase. I'll, I'll take anything. I think I'll, I'll keep going for, for pincer. We've had a phantom earlier. So the spreadsheet for Friend Safari, I'm sorry that it's locked behind my Discord server. I don't want to do that, but I locked it behind the Discord server just because the mods and I were a little nervous that, you know, if we made it open to anybody, somebody would just come into the Twitch chat and, you know, destroy the spreadsheet. We do have a master and like backup copy and whatnot, but we just wanted to avoid that. So you do have to join the Discord and you need to be of age to join. If you want access to the spreadsheet, um, but if you're a friend of mine and you would like access to the spreadsheet, please just DM me. You do not have to join the discord. Um, there are a lot of good, the spreadsheet is organized very nicely. So you can like see what Pokemon people have in their Safari and whatnot, which is nice. Your original DS still works. Thought it was broken. Just needed a charge. <laughs> That is iconic. I would do anything to figure out where my DS and DS Lite are. Who knows where they are? What's up, Locus Pocus? How are you, gamer? Hope you're well. Failed a phantom. It'd be like that. Your OG Switch was bricked for like a year and randomly started working again? My OG, my Switch, my 2017 Switch is so loud whenever I boot it up. The fan, when I play Splatoon on that thing, it is so loud. I like don't want to play on it because it is just... It's really loud. It scares me. <laughs> Is why you don't stream Jackbox? Yeah, I would never. I, I even had trouble streaming Mario Kart on stream because people would come in and ruin the fun. It's tough out there. which runs like a jet engine. <laughs> yeah, it's really, really loud whenever I, I play on my original Switch. I haven't, Kelly. I have not touched Stardew since last week. I'm still stuck in summer. I would like to play more Stardew. I just have been so busy this past week and a half. I have like had no time to game for, for fun. Oh, Georgie, congrats, gamer. I think I, I'm in your safari right now, Georgie, I think. There's so much in the 1.6 update for Stardew that I have not seen yet. I should probably just go ahead and read the patch notes and just like, you know, see it. Because I know I'm going to get spoiled eventually. Run marbles on it. Yeah, hopefully the Stardew update comes comes out on Switch soon. It it came out pretty quickly. 1.5 came out pretty quickly on the Switch. So I'm hoping 1.6. I think it was like a few, only like two months or something, or just like a few months. Hoping it's it's faster than that, but we'll see. Who knows? Exactly, Alola. You can get spoiled. Just spoil it for yourself. What is Poppin doing up there? He is just looking. It's 
so much work to do on your co-op farm. I hope that the co-op farming has been fun. Hello, Boz Moz. Okay, ads are starting in one minute, gamers. Enjoy your advertisement. Whatever you get, I hope it's a good one. You bought a fan replacement for your day one switch? I should maybe do that. Can't even take it apart. Oh no. Yeah, I just would not touch that thing then. What the heck is this song from? I recognize it. Is this from the Mario Kart D DS records? Iconic. Here is the new playlist for anybody wondering the vibes, the new autoplay. A complete sentence. The ad manager on Twitch sucks so bad. I, I really wish we could... I, I would rather just, like, not, you know? Play an ad, but I try to make the ads a little bit more manageable. Um... But the ad manager has been, like, really, really bad lately. It's very, like, stuttery. It's weird. What's up, Toad? How are you, gamer? Hope you're well. Oh my god. Of course, Badger Lord. And also, let me make one thing clear here. If you join the Discord just to get access for the uh, spreadsheet and then leave, that is okay. <laughs> I have no problem with that. I already feel bad making the spreadsheet, like, behind the, uh, the Discord server. But, like, it's just for safety reasons, just to keep it from people messing it up, you know? No, I will not be offended if you leave immediately. <laughs> We tried to think of some other ways, like maybe doing like a password or we, we tried to think of any other way to do it besides the Discord, but just seemed like the best version. Best way to go about it. The next message getting blocked. Oh, because you said add. <laughs> The cat pictures are pretty good when you remember to look at them, Nathan. I, I have to just simply agree. Join for the pretzel pictures, not the spreadsheet. Yeah, exactly. Got the four of the same Honda ads in a row. There are some like pretty bad ads on Twitch. Like just disturbing ones that make you feel kind of uncomfy. There was like some pizza ad. 
where the person in the advertisement was like eating the pizza very loudly and it made me upset also there was like some horror movie ad or something that was like just it was too much it's too much sometimes they can be pretty bad yeah they are no good shiny panda I wish you can control, you have more control over the ads that got played on your, like, any channel, YouTube, Twitch, whatever. If they b brought the friend safari back. What's up, Tempest? How are you, gamer? Yeah, I have never really... ASMR in general, like, it doesn't matter what it is. It all makes me a little... Like, I totally understand and support people who enjoy it. Because, like, for a lot of people I know, it really helps them, like, fall asleep. It, like, makes me so uncomfy. I cannot stand when people whisper. Like, I'm like... <laughs> I just can't do it. Even if, like, I'm in a quiet area and somebody tries to whisper to me, I'm like, just wait, just save it for later. Like, I don't want to know. <laughs> oh, let's go. Banger alert. Yeah, Dijon, I've seen that one. That one can that that's like a heavy heavy ad. You know something that I have been really enjoying lately? I've talked about this on stream before. Instagram reels keeps serving me those reels of the guy with the like clay ball. Like the two different color clay balls, and then he'll mix them together and you have to like guess what the color is gonna be at the end. Now that is, that is fun. And it, the color ends up being something like so stupid. That is also an incredible Instagram account. He has his pickle. I've talked about it a million times. You know it's a good day when that cat has his pickle. I believe the Instagram account is literally just called he has his pickle. <laughs> I have the post notifications turned on. It's the only Instagram account I, I care for if I'm keeping it real. Yeah, I also think I'm pretty bad at whispering, honestly. Fork, no, look for it, look for it on Instagram. <laughs> not, not, not Google. Instagram is the way to go. like a stage whisper it's a pretty great instagram account the the the, the owner of the the cat and account they just post anytime that cat has his pickle <laughs> it's pretty great yeah i like beautifully shiny when we found one in Legends Arceus, I was very... That and Motham. I was like, very great. Oh, 
Understandable, Callie. Understandable. Hello, Panda. All right, believers. I'll go for probably like 45 minutes, 40 minutes. Zach, there's definitely I, I I saw one hair across in the in the spreadsheet. Somebody definitely has hair across as their third gamer. Oh, banger song. Kelly, congratulations. You won't regret it. You have missed every bone rush. This is you hate to see it. Kelly, I've not seen this duck. I'm assuming it was just like a social media duck. My nose is so itchy. Oh my goodness. Is this in Scarlet and Violet? Shiny Rowlet? I swear to why do all the starters have a <laughs> have a self-damaging move? On TikTok, that's so sad. That squirtle felt pretty bad. Never forget it. Oh no, that's how you felt the Phantom. Not enough, not enough balls. We we have a we have a good amount of Pokeballs right now. It may not seem like it, but I promise we do. <laughs> oh, failed the Lapras once. Somebody in the spreadsheet has a Lapras. I need to check and see who that is. If I added them or not. Because Lapras would be fun. It's very funny to see like Spear Tomb Lapras in this grass. <laughs> Well, Robert, you could you could make an ultimate comeback here. Redeem. Reclaim. Uh, Ledger, thank you for the prime. Thank you, gamer. I hope you enjoy your Arl gone. It is always so sad, Kelly. Truly ruins, ruins my day. Why do they want a parish song? Messed up. Yeah, Dijon, we'll be doing this tomorrow, Thursday, and Friday as well. We will be continuing friend safariing as much as possible.
We have one. There's only one guy with a flying type friend safari. Is Kelly the only one with the fairy type safari? Oh, Nathan, you have a flying safari? The Pokemon in there are mid, Jack. That is how I feel about my friend safari. <laughs> Any, anytime anybody asks about it, I'm like, you don't want to add me. Oh, there's two. Okay. Complex Milk has a fairy type. Let me check it out. Yeah, there are a few gamers who have multiple friend safaris. Uh, multiple friend codes to add. So scroll over to the right. Okay, there's Kelly's fairy type. Oh, okay, I see the one with the Swirlix. Oh, there are a few. There are a few fairy type ones. Nice. Very nice, very, very, very nice. Your OG 3DS. Togepi and Clefairy. Ooh, Smeargle is in Reeds. Friend Safari, that is fun. Lillipup. Oh, we got some more ice type ones. That's exciting. Jeff has a flying type one. I'm excited about that dark type friend safari. Very, very much looking forward to that. I know Poffin has been napping all day up there. He is exhausted. A long day of playing with his ball at 3 a.m., you know? He is exhausted from being a baby! The, okay, so to access the spreadsheet, when you go into the Discord... Go to the Friend Codes channel. And then hit the pin, pinned messages button, top right. And in that channel, everybody is like, you know, helping people figure out their, the Pokemon in their friend safari and whatnot. Um, but also the, the, the thing is, uh, the spreadsheet is linked in there as well. Also, just a reminder, you don't want my friend Safari. It is very boring. <laughs> Whoever gets the pan pour. Jell, I think you you found a shiny Eevee earlier, right? Congratulations. Huge. I think it is so funny people find a Stunfisk. Why aren't we on to Sarah's Pikachu? Oh, I sure have, Yoshi. Clay and I once spent like two hours listening to like... I think it was like the Diamond and Pearl playlist trying to guess the songs. Good times. Ollie has the exact same friend safari? Wow. That's good. There, there is another person who has Stunfisk if you are interested in Stunfisk.
the first of eight working on the shiny elephant now very nice very nice committed to listening to it for the rest of the week <laughs> that is iconic behavior ever play on a gba in bed that's such a specific question alarmingly specific the steel type safari yeah that is the vibe for sure shout out to the gamers with the good safaris y'all are probably going through it with the with the friend codes outcast i'll probably be alive for maybe another like 30 minutes 45 minutes but i will be live every day this week The elephant must be found. The fan fee. Hunting the frog. Safari from back in the day. The Denny is what I want to hunt for the most. I would... I, I, if somebody has a Dedene on the spreadsheet, I will add them immediately. That is definitely one I want to go for. I love Lil Dedene. Good luck with the, the, <laughs> the elephants and the spear tombs. Those are the, the ones to get. I'm going until I find beautiful. Yeah. I have to finish my taxes today, so I can't stream too long. I, I sure will, Scrap. Adult moment. Huge pain moment. Gosh. <laughs> because I built my PC last year, I, I need to, like, find all the parts and whatnot and where I bought them to write it off tonight. Stain, have a good night, gamer. Exactly, Churchy. Born to Safari, to friend Safari hunt. Forced to taxes. Forced to taxes. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, going for trap inch buckeye? Very fun. Took you five hours to do your taxes. I'm very grateful to have a family member who, you know, knows how to do them. But Clay sat down the other day and, like, really dedicated the time to learning how to just do it himself. And I think he figured it out. Hopefully. I'll let y'all know. <laughs> if you never see him stream again, then you can just take that as a sign that he did his taxes wrong. Of course, Jib. Hope you're, hopefully you're, you're finding some cool things. And hopefully it's given people an opportunity to friend Safari who, you know, never got to friend Safari back in the day or just never was interested in it. <laughs> Scrap. It's been really fun. And and things like doing things like this always just reminds me about just like how much I love Pokemon and how it brings can really bring people together. Just reminds me a lot of my childhood and playing Pokemon with friends. You can dupe your data? Nice, Nathan. <laughs> That's not a whimsicott? This is a whims this is what whimsicott looks like if you give him a haircut. That's what he looks like under all that all that hair.
Yeah, once you cut off the hair, Whimsicott finally can can actually fully extend his neck. Make it complicated that you need to hire an accountant to help. It's messed up. I, I, it, there's just so much, there's so much. It's whatever. It's so, it, it's crazy how like whenever we talk about taxes and like people in other countries are just like, what? How is that allowed? I've noticed that happening a lot on stream. Oh, nice, Dijon. Yeah, I fear how much I will owe. We, we'll see. Scrap drive safe, gamer. And then work handles it all. That is very nice. Only ever have a W-2. Me too, Dark Knight. I'm big respect for Clay. He like really sat down and learned how to do it on his own. It took him like all day, but he did it. Yeah, that is what Clay did. He found some, he was recommended some site that like was completely free, I think. Talk about taxes. Free tax USA. Have a little pajama moment. What are you talking about? You woke up this morning to a tow truck pulling up to your car. He was going to take your car? Were you parked somewhere weird, Scrap? What happened with that? Yeah, that's what I do, Nathan. My dad just does mine. It's really, really handy. All of a sudden, they mined it. Interesting. Double Dash goes crazy, y'all. <laughs> I haven't played it in so long, but... Man, was it a good time. That's so annoying, Churchy. The people who parallel park every day, y'all are real ones. I'm honestly surprised we haven't gotten any sort of... I don't know. I, I, I feel like Double Dash is really loved, but I don't know. For two riders, it would be so awesome. Agreed. Maybe, like, even if they just gave you the option, you know? Jack, I, I definitely have trouble with it. I think I'm just not confident in myself. 
And also, my driver's test, like, didn't really give you... Like, it wasn't required for you to pass the parallel parking portion. And also, the driver's test, like, the, the parallel parking portion of my driver's test was so stupid because you had to, you weren't allowed to, like, put your car into drive. You had to do it all in one motion, reversing. And if you, like, tried to, to drive a little bit, you automatically failed. And it's just, like, that's not realistic to me. Yeah, without your backup camera. <laughs> yeah, I've heard a lot of, uh, uh, like, some people are just not allowed to, like... They didn't have to parallel park at all. I know, it's not realistic at all. It's so silly. Your dad made you practice for a long time. That is good. Something you do maybe three times a year. The hunting is going, Walker. Nothing else has shined for us yet, but that's okay. Some places parallel is over. Yeah, that's how I feel here, where I live now. It definitely feels like a required skill. You didn't have to do it well. You learned it with, without your camera, but they didn't cover it during your test. Yeah, of course you would use it. This is in the rear view mirror. Interesting. Didn't have to do any reversing, let alone parallel parking. I got one tick on my driver's test because I rolled the stop sign. But you know what? I don't think I did. Getting my, my license was so scary because the person who went before me failed and was like crying in the car and wouldn't get out of the car. And I was like, oh boy. <laughs> I was, yeah, I was too good for them, Churchy. <laughs> oh, and a full-size van. My dad, growing up, had a truck. So driving in that, I feel like, has done me good when it comes to driving big cars. My driver says honestly wasn't too bad, but I have heard in some like states and whatnot and locations where it's pretty tough. And I would probably fail in other places, but mine was really not that bad. Five times. I don't think my sister failed hers. Hero, we got a uh, phantom. A little bit earlier today. Can park large farm equipment in small places, no problem. Parallel parking, no thank you. Interesting. Yeah, my test was not bad, but I do remember my permit test being pretty bad. I think I failed that the first time. It was just like a written test. Went to a test further away. Did you try it there or you just heard bad things, Joey? And then the DMV shut down. The DMV is truly something. It's crazy how that place sucks for like everybody everywhere.
you glanced at the backup camera. Are you, what, what, like. <laughs> oh, it's where your brother failed. <laughs> oh, banger song. Took 70 points off? Oh my god. Failed there once. It is one of the places of all time. This is true. Getting one, the waiting times are insane. Yeah, I fear having to like get my license updated for how long it will take. I honestly think I'll just keep it as a phantom. I kind of like it as is, honestly. Trevenant is pretty good. Is pretty great though. Something interesting about my license is that at the picture on my license is still is picture of 15 year old me or something. Like I've never updated my picture because when it was time to get my license renewed for the first time, it was during COVID. And so they were like, you can just renew it online and we send you your license and whatnot. And so I never had to get my picture like retaken because of that. So when I like go to buy a beer, it's just like that picture is 15 year old me. Hello, Ollie. Sometimes they don't believe it's you. I showed my license to a friend the other day and she was like, that doesn't even look like you at all. <laughs> Understandable, Joey. Understandable. New record, Ollie. Let's go. Cleffa always throws up whenever we travel with her. Like, anytime she has to go in the car, she always throws up. She didn't throw up one time taking her from Georgia to California. Go our pets. <laughs> Shiny panda. <laughs> In, in the next two weeks, get the picture retaken. I fear getting my picture retaken. I'm scared. My picture on my license is honestly not too bad. Oh, nice water wolf. Ancient seed is huge. Especially in spring year one. My picture could definitely be worse. My passport picture, I, 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 it is awful. My passport's about to expire though, so it's fine. That is a bad picture. Where they manually lower the quality. Oh no. 
A pink eyeshadow betrayed you. Gwendolyn, have a good night. Making all the copper tools. Very nice. That is a vibe. Your students haven't shown up. A little Pokemon on ours. So far, uh, yesterday and today, we have found a shiny Pumpkaboo and a Phantom, and that's it so far. That's all. to watch streams and do homework in the downtime between classes i don't think i've ever had a job like i've never had like a sit down office job before so i've never like you know yeah a lot of tra trade evolution <laughs> shiny pokemon <laughs> What's up, Sammy? Enjoy dinner, gamer. It's good to see ya. Oh, to be a shiny bug in the grass. Would be the vibe. Sit down office jobs are not the vibe. Would not recommend. My last job before doing this full time was um what's it called was being a server and that was something but i'm i'm so happy i served served because i learned a lot and it was genuinely pretty good money sometimes it could be awful money but it was really good money and it taught me a lot Thank you for your service. And I honestly really enjoyed my server job because like as a waitress, I, I mainly worked night shifts. And so because of that, like you were just so busy, you had no downtime and your shifts would fly by. And like, yeah, it would be very stressful and sometimes truly the worst, but they flew by. So obviously, you know, you had to deal with the bad people here and there, but for the most part, it was good money and it flew by and there were great people on my job. Blockmaster, have a good night, gamer. We'll see you later. Enjoy the rest of your Tuesday. But yeah, once I think that I genuinely believe that once you stop working at a restaurant, if it's been more than like a year or two, <laughs> it's like so hard to go back to any restaurant job, any food industry. I did. Yeah, I my entire income was based on tips, Pixelbees. I think the biggest tip I ever got was like one hundred and fifty dollars. Or maybe $200. I had this incredible family come in and were asking me a lot of questions about like just my life and whatnot and how long I had been serving and what I wanted to do with my life. And they tipped me $250. $200? I think it was $200. I believe it was just, just $200. 
But for every $200 tip, there, you know, somebody tipping you literally nothing. It's awesome. It's great. Many times I, I was, I was not, I, I got stiffed. Oh my God, Joey, when I was a cashier, that happened a lot. As a cashier, like we weren't allowed to accept tips. But the old people would always try to tip you. And I just took it. Like, I know you, we weren't supposed to, but I just took it. <laughs> but we were not supposed to as, a, as cashiers. You earned it. <laughs> yeah, I think our management didn't really care. If we took them or not. Kelly! <laughs> Sell those apples. They were never paying you enough in the first place. Absolutely, yeah. God, my 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 cashier job was awful. Yeah, absolutely, Melodia. Like, uh, if you used to serve, if you were a waitress or waiter, or whatever, oftentimes you get it. The other day, Clay and I went to go see Dune 2, and everybody was throwing away their, like, trash and whatnot in this super, super, super full trash can that, like, was just in so full. Like, they were, like, piling on top of the trash can. And without even, like, saying anything to each other, me and Clay both just walked past it and threw our stuff away in a different trash can. And I think that was because we both have worked, you know in the customer service food industry business and we just get it and we're just like why would we contribute to that mess you just have like after you've been in in it you just you're a different person forever oh my god buckeye no good very bad That is also just common sense as well in the trout, but you you would think more people. So many people go back to being menaces. Oh my goodness, yeah. I can't even imagine. 13 years. They really are- they are something else, Yoshi. It's crazy that they exist. You might, Lionheart, depending on where your copy of X and Y is at. Hello, Cobb. There's no sense that is common. Yeah, shopping carts as well. I will always put that thing back. It made you more patient, Chemical Bomb. Ooh! You also have a fan fee, Friend Safari? <laughs> God, I know coldest case. I, I genuinely, like, they have to be... Like, how are you not embarrassed? Yelling at a child? 
who like I I I All right, gamers, let's do 10 more encounters. We'll see. We'll see what where this gets us. Believers, this one's for you. The final countdown. Miss L, good luck with the Splatoon. Believers, let's get it. <laughs> I love you. Come back again. Banger song. Waterwolf, enjoy, enjoy. We'll see you later. day of friends safariing definitely the numbers were lower shiny wise for the community but i'm just happy to find that that phantom pretty early into stream rather than like end of stream <laughs> joey there I, i'm telling you sometimes when you sleep too much <laughs> people like that coldest case like it's truly unbelievable that they exist i just i can't imagine like humiliating embarrassing myself like that out in public everybody is gonna judge you Oh no, Amelia. No good. Need to transform into Snorlax. All your problems will be solved. We have found two so far, Tama. Two. All right, Pinsir one. Let's do three more. That is awful, Amelia. I'm sorry to hear that. Hello, do. Oh. Kelly, that is awful. Then, pincer number two. All right, let's get let let's do not even one more encounter. Let's do one more pincer. Just one more. Do hope you're well, gamer. It's good to see you. Hello, hello. Because she's, well, you stopped showing the movie off that she wanted to see. That is, that is interesting. Georgie, it's all good. No worries. <laughs> I'm just happy to be seeing some other Pokemon. No pincer. I worked with some very, very interesting characters whenever I was a server. That is for sure. I had one of my coworkers yell at me because I was talking. Oh my God. This is a whole story. You know what? I'm not even going to get into it. Basically one. Okay. I'm getting into it. One server didn't like me very much because I called her out for being literally racist. She it was a disgusting, vile person, like truly scum of the earth, racist person ever and i told my boss i didn't want to work with her anymore and then one day i was talking kind of poorly about one of my coworkers because she was just a terrible person and wasn't helping out at all and this racist coworker overheard me talking poorly about this other coworker, and she already didn't like me because i 
was trying to never work with her again because she was just awful. Anyway, that racist coworker ended up telling the girl that I was talking poorly about her and she came and yelled at me, like screamed in my face and then ended up, ended up getting fired that day because she was such a bad worker. I really worked with some characters. That is, that is for sure. It was, it was something. All right, I got to pay out this, uh, yells in my face, immediately gets fired. Like good riddance, girl. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. 3% on nothing. I'm sorry, gamers. Y'all are not getting paid. 16 people on Pinsir, 13 people on Beautifly, and 7 on Butterfree. Ending on, on the roost. <laughs> they got fired, Joey. She was a terrible worker. She was so bad, which was why I was talking poorly and complaining about her. And she ended up getting fired because she was such a terrible worker. But anyway, sorry, sorry, believers, but the doubters have won. Good time. It's always fun to reflect on. On the good old serving stories. <laughs> Three hours of work for no kips. I'm still happy I worked that job though. Ladies and gentlemen, James, and hello gamer. Oh my goodness, you're coming in at the end. I'm so sorry. But hello, how was your stream? What are we all up to? Hello, hello. Save one more time. Hello, hello gamer. 3DS online plays is going offline soon. It sure is April 8th. Got less than a week. James, how was your stream? Welcome on in, y'all. We are we're currently doing a lot of friend safari shiny hunting um, on stream this week, and it's been a it's been a grand old time. We found a phantom today, pumpkaboo yesterday. A lot of lot of grass ghost types. Something to think about. I hope stream was lovely, James. It's good to see ya. All right, let's see who is live. Who's Zigzagoon? What game, James? Is this Sword and Shield? Boomstiv is live today. Um, possibly we could go here. Banger song. Thank you, gamers. Thank you for hanging out today. Is Cleffa still in hiding? I'm not even sure where she is right now. She was on stream earlier, though. Thank you all for friend safariing today. A slower friend safari day for sure, but tomorrow we'll make it back up. Surely we will be swimming. The gamers will be swimming. Yeah, thank you all for hanging out. Thank you, thank you. Hopefully the, the elephant shines for a few people tomorrow. We'll see. We'll be live again tomorrow. Normally I'm not live on Wednesdays, but we'll be live tomorrow. We will be gaming. Um, yeah, have a good night, gamers. If you'd like to join the raid, feel free to. You get channel points. So if you just lost some channel points, feel free to join. Okay, I want to raid this person. I've never raided them before, but I'm, I fear people spoiling him. So I will raid this person instead. It was a it was a good day, y'all. Say goodbye to Poffin. He's still up there. He is still asleep. He is just he is so tired. He's exhausted. Alright, let's go raid Evie. Let's go say hello. Evie is oh my goodness, she's at 12,100 for Swablu right now. 
She's an icon. I love Evie. Evie's doing some Dynamax, Dynamax adventures as well as some sapphire shiny hunting on the side. Evie is great. Go say hello. What is this music? It is called Please Don't Inhale the Cinema Patrons from Kirby and the Forgotten Land. <laughs> Banger song. Um, thank you all so much for friend safariing today. Thank you, thank you. Um, it's an incredible song title. Go say hi to Evie. Thank you all so much for hanging out. If you'd like to join the raid, feel free to drop this raid message. Just just throw an Arl gone out there and, and see what happens. Yeah, I'll be live again tomorrow. I'll see you all. Uh, James, thank you again so much for the raid. Sorry that you're coming in at the end, but thank you, thank you. <laughs> I do want Evie's the DNA, but it's okay. Um, yeah, have a great night, gamers. Take care of yourselves. I'll see you in every stream, and I'll see you tomorrow. Good luck with the friend safari and if you do friend safari off stream. And I'll see you tomorrow, gamers. Bye. Oh, no. It won't let me raid. What? Where'd it go? It won't let me press the raid button. Oh, no. Okay, well... It says four seconds. Three. Okay, here we go. All right, right now. Bye. <laughs>